Welcome to Frank Bruno Law. I'm Frank Bruno. I'm an elder law and estate planning attorney in Queens, New York. I've been serving Queens and the surrounding counties for more than 20 years. Today, I'd like to speak to you about beneficiary designations. Before I do that, I'd like to let you know, if you wanna meet with me, if you have a question, if you'd like to speak with me on the phone, please check out my website, frankbrunolaw.com, and you can find my scheduling page at callfrankbruno.com. Beneficiary designations, what are they? Well, uh, life insurance policies, annuities, and retirement accounts allow you to designate a beneficiary. That means upon your death, uh, the, the sums of money within those um, uh, financial instruments goes directly uh, to your beneficiary. Um, there's a pro to that. Uh, the, uh, the pros are you avoid the cost and the delay associated with probate. It's also uh, not a public event. All the beneficiary has to do is produce a death certificate provided to that uh, institution and the money will be given directly to them. Now there's a con. The con is that the beneficiary designation will defeat your, your will or trust. It happens by operation of law and meaning it's automatic. Now, uh, it is a very useful uh, technique within a larger estate plan. You may very well uh, want to avoid probate and the costs associated, uh, but you have to uh, determine within the grand scheme what you wanna do and how you wanna do it. Now, who can be a beneficiary uh, and who can you designate? Well, it could be your spouse, uh, it could be your children, it could be your charitable organization, it could be uh, your significant other, uh, it could be your own trust, it's whoever you wanna name. Uh, I will tell you that you should keep your beneficiary designations up to date uh, and uh, some of the milestone events in your life, uh, births, deaths, remarriage. Uh, you'd be in a, in, you would be in significant trouble if you left your uh, ex-spouse as the beneficiary of your life insurance policy. I don't think too many people would wanna do that. Again, if you need to speak with me, if you'd like to speak with me, please go to callfrankbruno.com. Thank you.